Red Dog Howls is really a story about a man trying to find out about his past so that he might have a better grasp at solidifying his future. The play lands in a very particular way for Armenian audiences. I think that its power is that it is not talking about just this particular war, but all wars and what wars make people do and what wars do to people. My grandmother, my father's mother was Armenian and she raised me from a small age when my mother wasn't around. And then there were times when my grandmother would just talk to me about horrible, I remember being very young and speaking about horrible things that happened. The character of Rose is fundamentally based on my memory of my grandmother. Matter of fact, they share the same name. My grandmother was Vartui, which is in Armenian means Rose, and she was a piece of iron, that woman. I find uh, Rose's character and Rose's story both incredibly moving and deeply, deeply troubling. You realize that's $81? It's not too much. We're playing for a nickel a point. You're getting much better. Just feel the cards. You do it for me. I am busy. Kathleen does strength and humor in a way very few actresses, with a sort of mastery of it, in a way very few actresses can. Here's a woman who, because of the course her life has taken, um, was required to be stronger than anybody could possibly imagine. So in fleshing out the character, I wanted to make the physical trait and the emotional trait feel so strong that by the time you get to the end of play, you'd imagine that she could have superhuman strength, that somebody would need superhuman strength to survive what, what she survived. I see Rose as someone who's suffering from PTSD in the most profound way. Maybe the overarching issue for Rose is the thing that she believes that she did wrong. The way in which she was complicit in, in what happened. Whatever they think of the play, there's nobody that's gonna leave that theater and not say, Kathleen Chalfant was a wonder in that piece because she's flat out that. Um, and even I, she taught me so much about my own play just by acting it, you know, just by being curious and being Kathy. Red Dog Hells is frightening, provocative, tricky, political, and immensely human play about war and what war means and what war means to the combatants, what it does to the victors and what it does to the losers. How it seems to be woven into the fabric of humanity on the one hand and is the most deeply inhumane of human activities. <laughs>